orange. Ooh, this lighting is not cute. If you follow me, baby, Welcome back, Mama Maniac. Today is the Women's March LA, and I'm so honored that I get to be a part of it. Not only do I get to be a part of it, but I'm introducing one of the speakers, and I'm just super honored to be attached to the Women's March. The only downside that is making my heart hurt is I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to vlog there. I'm going to record all that I possibly can leading up to it. We'll see about anything being filmed. And I'm actually releasing this video that I'm recording the same day. So, Lord, <laughs> it's gonna be intense. They are expecting a million people there. Last year I was there and I actually danced with Sasha and there was over 750,000 people at this event. If I didn't have people guiding me through the march, I would have been lost because all I see is tushy. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds like a song waiting to happen. All I see is tushy. All I see is tushy. All I see is tushy. <laughs> I still don't have any makeup on, so we gotta go fix that. My hair, this is from yesterday. So we gotta go fix that. That's it, it's gonna be a great day because it's Women's March! For those of you that don't know what Women's March is, it's basically the ability to have a voice. You deserve to have a voice. I deserve to have a voice. And they all deserve to be heard. Tireless, poor, yearning to breathe free, to breathe free. Every single day, your job as an American citizen is not just to fight for your rights, it's to fight for the right of every individual that is taking a breath whose heart is pumping and breathing on this earth. No matter what nationality you are, no matter what size you are, no matter what handicap you have, no matter if you're a girl or you're a guy. Last year we were the largest march in the country. This year we are the largest march in the country. It's so powerful to stand together as a woman or a man and say, I'm not going to stand for it and I have a voice against it. We'll always support you, stand behind you, beside you, so that you don't have to stand alone. In Los Angeles, California, it's 52 degrees with clear skies and sun. Today, you can look for mostly sunny weather, with a high of 62 degrees and a low of 42 degrees. We were all here a year ago for many different reasons. But one of the unifying reasons was we were scared. I quickly adjusted my behavior. I rejected any role that even had a kissing scene and talked about that choice deliberately in interviews. I emphasized how bookish I was and how serious I was and I cultivated an elegant way of dressing. I built a reputation for basically being prudish, conservative, nerdy, serious, in an attempt to feel that my body was safe and that my voice would be listened to. Hey guys, we actually made it in. We are here at the Women's March LA, and as you can see, it is crazy, but crazy in a great way. Women can truly rock. 2017 is over! In spite of the crackery, we will continue to build. We will continue to reason together. You want 2018 to be better than 17? We gotta get everybody eligible, registered, and ready to roll. Martin Luther King, and what he said about time is, he said, I'm not ready to wait 100 or 200 years for things to change that I think actually that time is neutral. That it can either be used constructively or destructively. 
destructive way. That human progress rarely rolls in on inevitability. It is through human dedication and effort that we move forward. Anti-immigration policies, we will fight back. We will stand up and we will make sure that our families remain together. Organizers of today's event, Dina Katz and Morgan Kepner. Who's holding my microphone right now? That cat is not organized here. It's such a great cause, a great march, a great voice. And again, I'm just so proud to be a part of it. from the Women's March, and I'm so glad that I can spend the last moments with these guys before they go to sleep. The overall day at the Women's March was really amazing. Look, I'll get her distracted. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Look at these, Penny. There we go. Um, I was gonna, I was so excited because I was gonna wear these actually on stage when I got to introduce someone. That moment never happened but it was still great to be there and support a great cause and um, just be a part of a really great organization that supports women, women's rights. Yeah, are you touching them with your toes? <laughs> I'm a woman with a disability and I fully support Women's March LA. I'm going to put all of the Women's March information to nonprofit organization. I'm gonna put it in the description below. So please, dogs are back. <laughs> So, uh, 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 I see you. I see you. I want to say thank you because this is such a huge movement and to be a part of something that empowers everyone and makes everyone feel equal is very important, especially in today's society. And it's important to vote, it's important to have your vote, and it's important to feel like you matter in a world where I feel like a lot of negative things are showering down on us today. Today's shout out goes to Liz Heinrich. I think you're great, I love your comments, I love your energy. If you wanna be a part of the shout outs, all you have to do is be subscribed, be active on the channel, and you too can get a shout out on one of the daily vlogs. Thank you so much for being a part of today's vlog. I apologize for it getting out late, but I wanted it to really capture all of today. And it was very powerful and I will never forget it. Hi.